DJ Aaron Boone said tonight was intense. It was almost a playoff like atmosphere. How would you describe the atmosphere? Very, uh, yeah, very playoff like, um, pretty intense. A lot of fun to be a part of. How does that energy help you on the field? Um, I tell you what, when fans are into the game like they are, it's uh, makes it easy to play and um, makes it makes it a lot of fun for us. Bruce Beck, go ahead and unmute. DJ, who were you out there fighting for tonight? Were you fighting for the 2019 team, the 2017 team, for yourself, for your current teammates? Uh, yeah, I mean, you know, it was, um, <clears throat> you know, this this uh, series has kind of been circled by a lot of people um, for a while now. Um, but, uh, you know, it, like I said, it was a wild atmosphere. But, uh, you know, at the end of the day, we got to take care of business and, and get wins. Um, you know, we're not uh, in a position to be, you know, getting caught up in the moment. We need to take care of business. Did you enjoy this atmosphere tonight? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. Ken Davidoff, please unmute. Hey, DJ, what did you think of your uh, your hitting the sixth inning off the bat? Did you did you think it was slow enough? I guess to uh, <laughs> yeah, to, to say yeah, I thought it was slow enough. Um, uh, yeah, you know, I didn't. You know, I didn't know if he was going to be able to throw me out at first. I didn't know if he was going to be able to go home or, or whatnot. But, uh, you know, everyone was hustling and getting good leads. And really, um, you know, it was just kind of a, one of those lucky, well-placed hits. Thanks, DJ. Go next to Marley Rivera. <clears throat> Hi, DJ. We were just talking to Giancarlo, and he said that that kind of merciless booing that happened with the Astros, he had never experienced that uh, on a baseball field. How was your experience uh, seeing that from the other side? Yeah, same, same. Um, yeah, that was that was wild. It was wild. Um, but uh, like I said, it was a lot of fun to be a part of on our side, at least. What was wild about it, DJ? Obviously, we're not on the field with you. We just want to get a little bit of sense of it. Yeah, I just, um, you know, I think the fans, um, you know, have their opinion and, uh, you know, they, they let them know and they were, you know, behind our, you know, they had our backs the whole game. It was, uh, it was pretty... Uh, you know, to know the fans have our backs like that, it's, uh, it's pretty special. Christy Ackert, you have the next question. DJ, you said a lot of people had this one circled. Did you have this circled? Were you looking forward to this series? Um, yeah, yeah, absolutely. I mean, it's a good team, um, you know, and, and uh, we've had our battles with them. So anytime uh, we play them, it's going to be a good fight. Dusty Baker, Baker had said before they came in here, it was kind of time to get over this or over what happened. How do you feel about that? Uh, I don't think that it'll be, I don't think people will turn the page on that anytime soon. Thank you. Uh, go next to Lindsay Adler. DJ, like you said, the fans had your back. Do you feel like at this point, you guys need to sort of just focus on playing and let, and let the fans, um, be the ones to express the frustration against the Astros. Uh, yeah, I mean, you know, like I said, we need we need we need to take care of business on the field. I mean, that's our number one goal. Um, there's going to be a lot of noise, um, you know, but uh, at the end of the day, we need to take care of business, and I felt like we did a really good job of that tonight, and I know we will the next two nights.